So recently there's been a theory or a rumour going around, it's more of a theory, going around about the Rick and Michonne spin-off. Um, it's, a, it's an interesting theory, I think, but uh, overall, personally, before I get into talking about this theory, I don't think this theory is um, going to happen. Um, well, fortunately, it's not going to happen. Uh, personally, I don't think it will happen, and I don't think I think other people and other Walking Dead fans think it it's not going to happen either. Um... But yeah, obviously I'll talk about it in a minute. So yeah, if you do enjoy this video today, uh, please like and subscribe and let's get into it. So basically the theory going around uh, recently in the Walking Dead community with the Rick and Michonne spinoff is that Rick Grimes is actually already dead. Um, and obviously as we saw in the season 11 finale in the last episode, we see right at the end Michonne is still looking for Rick. As we see on the horse, you know, she goes into that massive horde of walkers. And then we see Rick, which is obviously taking place a year earlier. So that means it's taking place whilst Michonne is already, um, is obviously looking for him already, you know, bef when she was, um, before, or I mean, after the Whisperer War, when they were looking for, uh, when she was looking for Rick and obviously because she finds the phone and obviously in that last episode with Rick we see that he has the phone on him and he he puts on that phone Michonne and Judith and he throws his stuff onto the uh the boat which obviously Michonne finds in that epi on in her last episode on in The Walking Dead in season 10 um so yeah that that obviously takes place before so we we literally still don't know what Rick is doing like exactly at that time uh, in The Walking Dead during season 11 because that scene where we saw Rick takes place literally before well Michonne hasn't even left to go and look for him yet because she thinks he's dead already well she has the idea that he's dead already and obviously we see that she finds that phone which we saw in the season 11 of the last episode that Rick puts on that boat and then he, he obviously got captured again so we don't know where Rick is and we don't know what Rick's doing so I understand the theories of people thinking that Rick Grimes is or is actually dead prior well what's actually happening in The Walking Dead at the moment that Rick is actually already dead but I don't think this theory is true. I don't think there's going to be any truth behind that. I think that this sh it wouldn't make much sense for the, the spin-off um, just to be about, you know, Michonne going to find Rick. And then once she finds him, he's already going to be dead. And then Rick is obviously what it's going to show us the backstory of what Rick's been doing. I don't think that's what this spin-off is going to be about because we've had... I guess, like, the description for the show, and it, it tells us that it's going to be, like, a love story and all this stuff about between Mick, Rick and Mich Michonne, and it's obviously going to be about Rick escaping for the CRM because it wouldn't make much sense him being dead already. It just doesn't... To me, it doesn't really make sense, and I'm I'm sure other Walking Dead fans can agree with me. Don't get me wrong. I think this theory is very interesting. Um, Obviously, we don't want it to happen because we don't, we don't want Rick to be dead yet. We want to see him more. I think it would be stupid for The Walking Dead and Angela Kang and, you know, the head writers of these spinoffs to say that Rick's dead already because I think all of these spinoffs, not just this one, I think the Daryl one and the uh, Negan and Maggie one, I think they're all leading up to something big, as I've said in previous videos. I think this, this is leading up to like, the end game of The Walking Dead, as I also previously said. And Rick is obviously going to be the, the leader of all of this. He's gonna We're going to be into this sort of with the MCU. You know, we had Tony Stark as that sort of uh head character i think obviously that's going to be rick in the walking dead universe and you know i've made a video in the past about a commonwealth um a, a show about the commonwealth and maybe rick could be in that and that will be be against the crm but we don't really know yet but overall this theory is pretty cool um i think it is interesting to you know look at look at and you know theorize i guess and talk about but at the end of the day i don't want it to happen and i don't think it will happen because you know, Rick can't be Ted, you know, we, all of us Walking Dead fans want to see Rick more, we want to see more of him in, in the Walking Dead universe, and this show, we've literally got in the description that it's going to be like a love show between Rick and Michonne, and obviously we're going to see them escape, and we can't wait to see the reunion of Michonne and Rick, and obviously Rick and Judith, and all the other characters that Rick will reunite with, and you know, we have to see a reunion with, between Rick and Daryl, that's what Walking Dead fans have been crying for since, you know, Rick has left the show and since Daryl has been looking for Rick you know in those episodes where where Daryl was trying to look for him for all those years and he just couldn't find him because he was obviously going to CRM and we we have to see that reunion because you know fulfill us Walking Dead fans I don't think any of us Walking Dead fans are going to be truly happy until we see the reunion of Rick and Daryl and Rick and Judith and just Rick with all the the OG characters and him finding out about the deaths of you know, all of these other characters like Rosita, Enid and, you know, all the other characters that we, we loved and that Rick had interactions with. But yeah, I think this theory is, is, is cool to look at and, you know, like I said, talk about, but I don't think it make, it doesn't really make much sense for the story. 
uh, I see I've I've seen people comment it before on my videos and you know like I said it's it's a cool theory to to hear and listen to and you know theorize I guess about but at the end of the day I just feel like Rick isn't going to be dead I just feel like he's obviously he's been taken in as like a, a prisoner in the CRM because otherwise he wouldn't be trying to escape but then again we don't know what's happening at that at that moment in time because we don't know what he's doing right now uh, during season 11 because obviously that takes place the the time we see rick takes place during season 10 so we we still don't know what he he is actually doing but obviously we're going to find that out in the spin-off we're going to see what he's been doing and how like he's going to escape with michonne from the crm because that's obviously what the show is going to be about and that's what's going to happen and then we'll obviously see what happens after that because obviously the show is a limited to one season but i've always also seen rumors that it might be be given and renewed for a season two so i don't really know what's going on at the moment it obviously has been delayed well it probably will be delayed uh back to 2024 i doubt it'll be in a late 2023 release but yeah like i said this this theory is cool to um i guess to listen to, to or whatever just to talk about but you know i just don't think it will happen just because just because I the Walking Dead, you know, they want to make their money and they're going to make the money by bringing Rick back properly and giving him his proper ending, bring, giving him a proper reunion with other characters. And I just feel like they, they're they obviously going to do that because that's what we want to see. We want to see all of that. We don't want to see that. We don't want to start the spin off off with finding out that Rick is actually dead and or ending the show and finding out that Rick's dead. I just don't think that's good for the story. It's not good for the Walking Dead universe as a whole, to be honest. But yeah, so yeah, I just wanted to make this short video because I've seen I've been seeing these theories for quite a while now and I just wanted to make a quick video about it. I do think it's cool, but at the end of the day, I don't think it will happen and it shouldn't happen. So yeah, if you guys did enjoy this video today, please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.